you know, we had a new spokesperson. They changed the spokesperson of the IATF. Kasi dati, ang spokesperson, si Carlo Nograles. Tapos, ang nagsasalita sa, sa ano, si Yusek Berhere. Tapos, all the different agencies were actually talking. Yung DND, Department of National Defense. Yung DILG, nagsasalita din. Yung police, nagsasalita din. And then, when this new spokesperson came in, medyo... Sinabi, teka muna, we speak with one voice. Tama naman yung philosophy na yun. One message para hindi nalilito ang tao. Pero ang problema nung nangyari yun, na hug yung microphone, maraming hindi nasasabi that are happening at ground level. So meron na tayong national task force, nag implement ng national action plan. Nung una, kami yung naglabas nung mag tayo lahat. Ang punsan din yung Department of Health, kasi, ay, Department WHO, sabi nila, <laughs> healthcare workers lang. So, in-implement namin kasi tinignan namin yung mga bansa eh, na, na nag-work eh. Lahat sila may universal masking policy. So, na-implement yun. Pero after that, naging policy nga na, teka muna, huwag masyadong maraming talking heads. Now, we're suffering from that policy and we're recommending na we should have more talking heads. Look at uh, the U.S. All the top university professors are interviewed every day when I watch this uh, cable news. Talagang laging may professor sa Harvard, professor sa, sa ano, each state has their own top university and the top professors in emergency, in infectious disease, in epidemiology are all being interviewed. Kailangan natin ganun din dito. I think the people want information. Sabi nga namin sa, when I was studying disaster medicine and epidemics, the problem is not the infectiousness of the virus. Why? Because rumors spread faster than the virus. And that's our big problem. So when you have only one voice, more rumors will happen. Kasi walang, ano eh, walang, walang sources. So you need reliable sources, communication upwards to the president, communication lateral to the other doctors so that they understand what the National Task Force is doing, and communication downwards to the barangay level, to our lowly Filipino uh, men, who, men and women who actually have to behave correctly to fight this virus.